Hello everyone, welcome to the video where we are going to check about board exam, scheme for evaluation and paper pattern and in this video we will study only about information technology particularly for arts trade that is with the arts 98 group. So let's move ahead and check what is the scheme for evaluation, scheme of evaluation. So for your examination pattern the first will be your term one examination which will be of 50 marks and it will have two and a half hour as the time and the portion will be half of the syllabus that is any three topics can be selected. This will be theory examination which will be conducted at college level only. Now another exam will be the preliminary examination which will be for 80 marks prelims. It will be having the same time limit as two and a half hour and it will cover full syllabus and the pattern will be again theory examination which will be conducted at college level only. Now this 80 marks are divided into the combination of 60 and 20. So 60 marks will be based on objective content and 20 marks will be based on subjective content. So 60 plus 20 will go for 80. Now third examination will be for third level of examination that is preliminary practical it will be for 20 marks which will be for 3 hours. Now the practicals which you have conducted or which you have attended during the complete academic year those practicals will be the portion for examination and these will be the practical exam so the pattern will be practicals and which will be conducted at college level only into your computer lab. Now the board examination that is HSC board examination it will be the theory examination, we will have 80 marks, again 60 plus 20 combination, which will be for two and a half hours. It will have complete syllabus, full syllabus, and the examination will have online pattern. So online exam, theory pattern, as per Marath State Board High Secondary Board rules, so the timetable will be registered and accordingly you will be having examination. Again, as I said, that 80 is divided into the combination of 60 and 20 so 60 for objective and 20 for subjective now board exam practical board exam it will be again for 20 marks and it will have three hours the, as the preliminary practicals practicals will be conducted during your academic year those practicals will be asked and practicals at computer lab only will be taken in the college itself so as per that only practical examination will be there. We will go for the instructions which are there for practical board, uh, board practical examination. Now moving ahead, looking towards the sample question paper format for your term one or terminal examination, the, it will be having marks 50. So the exam will be for 50 marks and the questions are as given. So the first question is fill in the blank and the number of questions will be five. It will be having five marks. Second question is about true or false, questions 5 and 5 marks, multiple choice, single answer, single answers, so questions will be 10 having marks, 10, multiple choice, 2 correct answers, 5 questions will be there having 10 marks, multiple choice with 3 correct answers, so questions will be 2 and which will have 6 marks, accordingly said next question, match the following, the question numbers will be 4 and it will carry 4 marks. This will be your programming wala question. So programming wala question either or see the same number of question is given. So A or B in this also you will be having choice. So the, uh, there will be 2 questions and it will be having 5 marks. Similarly 2 questions for 5 marks. Chapters which are suggested for your term 1 examination are chapter 1, 2 and 4. So this with the 50% of syllabus we can have into terminal examination. Now topic wise if you need to check the weightage or chapter wise if you need to go ahead for the weightage of it. So the first chapter is about advanced web designing which carries 20 marks with option it will be 30. Second chapter is about e-commerce and e-governance. It will be having 10 marks with options it will be 12. Now third chapter is basics of audio and video editing. So the marks 14 and with options it will go for 14. Recent technologies in IT marks 10 with options it will go for 10 only. Open street map so marks 10 with options it will go for 12. Digital marketing 16 marks with options it will go for 18. So altogether 
with the option you will have 96 marks per pupil and where compulsory it will be for 80 marks. Now weightage if you need to check as per the objective question so it is based on the various uh, topics or units that unit name like knowledge compensation it will be knowledge compensation application and skill so in this four categories the marks are divided out of 80 now moving ahead for the uh, type of question so as we have discussed 60 plus 20 the combination 64 objective short and long answers for 10 10 all together it will go for 80 it is like marks wise distribution for 80 marks and if you need to go ahead for prelims or final IT examination, which will be of 80 marks, so the pattern is here somewhat different. So what's the pattern and differentiation? Fill in the blanks, so we will for 10 marks, and uh, which will be having 10 questions only. True, false, again 10 questions for 10 marks. Multiple choice, single answer. 10 questions for 10 marks, multiple choice, two correct answer. 10 questions, it will be doubled over here, 20. The correct answers, two questions will be there, which will be having six marks, match the following, four questions for four marks, answer briefly, there will be eight questions out of which you need to attempt any five questions, which will carry ten marks, and then solve any one of the code, so HTML, code, programs will be there uh, as a question, so either or you need to attempt the two questions, which will be having five marks. So this is about your final IT examination. Moving ahead for your practical examination. So instructions are given in this format. There will be practical of 20 marks out of which it will be 15 marks as per the distribution of the coding program. And then the final certified journal will have five marks which will complete your 20 marks over here. These document for downloading you can have into the same description box so that you can use this document, you can download it with the link which will be shared with you. So thank you for watching the video.